things around us introduction there are millions of different things in the world around us these things differ in many ways some of these objects are alive and some are not people cow sparrow and tree are alive but books stones chairs and tables are not in this chapter we will study the characteristics of the living things and non-living things cell all living and non-living things have mass and occupy space another common feature between living and non-living things is that they are made up of structural units molecules are the structural units of non-living things the structural unit of a living thing is the cell cells vary in size and shape there are different kinds of cells in the body of a living thing cells can be seen under a microscope differences differences between living and non-living things are shown in the table amoeba paramecium and yeast living organisms are made up of tiny units called cells and have a definite life cycle some plants and animals consist of only one cell all bacteria yeast a fungus and some plants living in water are one celled unicellular amoeba paramecium and many other animals are also made up of only a single cell there is no change in the number of cells throughout their life cycle the bigger the animal the greater the number of cells that make up its body living things grow living things usually do not remain the same size there is an increase in size as they grow older small seedlings grow into plants Many of them grow to become tall